Good evening, I'm Jessica Cartalia. Yuki is off, and we begin with the son of a Flyers legend making national headlines tonight. He was caught on video pushing an unoccupied wheelchair down a flight of stairs at a bar. Siafa Lewis joins us now with more. Siafa. Just the video of Carson Briere's brazen actions at an Erie area bar Saturday night has been viewed more than 23 million times. Carson, who you'll see in the backwards white cap, shoving that wheelchair down the flight of stairs. The wheelchair was at the top of the stairs because the young lady who owns it, a double amputee, was using the downstairs bathroom in the pre-ADA compliance building. Carson Briere, a member of the Mercyhurst University hockey team, issued this statement. I am deeply sorry for my behavior on Saturday. There is no excuse for my actions, and I will do whatever I can to make up for the serious lack of judgment. Carson's father, Danny, a former Flyers player and their current acting general manager, issued a statement of his own. I was shocked to see Carson's actions in the video that was shared on social media yesterday. They are inexcusable and run completely counter to our family's values on treating people with respect. Carson is very sorry and accepts full responsibility for his behavior. In Center City tonight, folks shared their thoughts. It's just kind of hurtful, you know, because that's a person that can't help their situation. You know, just an unfortunate circumstance in my opinion. It's a little disturbing um, to see something like that. It's just a disrespect to someone who's clearly not capable of doing the same things that he's capable of doing. CBS News Philadelphia also spoke to the head of security at the bar via phone. This is his lasting takeaway from the incident. I guess what I'd like everybody to take away from it is um, it's always a good time to be a decent human being. And when you're not a decent human being, there's eyes watching everywhere, and there's consequences to negative actions. Mercyhurst University issued a lengthy statement acknowledging Carson Breer's wrongdoing, but ending with this. Our mercy tradition also reminds us that students and all people who make poor choices deserve opportunities to learn, change behaviors, and atone for harmful actions. The young lady who posted the video of the incident and the bar's head of security, Nate Sanders, have raised over $8,100 as of this evening to buy a new wheelchair. Siafa Lewis, CBS News, Philadelphia.